In this video, I will show you how to make your project Plagaramic check proof. First, keep a copy of your report. I'll copy and I'll paste here. And I'll call it as report modified one. So let me open this. This part we cannot uh, do anything like what we cannot change what is written as RAM here to something else isn't it so what you can do for this just take a screenshot of this you now from let's say I'll capture this from here to here and what I'll do now I'll delete this chapter 4 right Go here, insert, then file. Short. Last one, short. So, what happens now? This has become an image. So, there cannot be any check on a image basically. So, it will be under percent programmatic check. And in your project, don't keep this kind of data, which is, you know, there's a text which can be checked. It should be an image. So take a screenshot of that and make an image. Other than that, what you can do is, now we have a few things you have to understand. These things also they'll compare with plagiarism check. So this you cannot change it, isn't it? Can you change the Vishwacharya Technological University to what? Sanket Technological University. No, isn't it? So what you can do is only this part you can just take a what image and put that image. So that will totally go unnoticed. So what other things you can do for the text which we cannot replace them as image is select the text which you want to do the check. So I will uh, select few words and you can look at the number of words here 600 that website where we are going to check will allow us to do the check for around 1000 words at a time so what i want you to do is copy that and go to this website let me visit this website this is the website as you can see here and go to this cop part and paste then what you do, click on I am not robot. It's with cars, okay. So just prove that you are not robot. And then click on check plagiarism and scroll down, wait for some time. It will start and it will scroll down. You can see that it is doing the plagiarism check. Please do not do the plagiarism check in any other website other than this. There are some websites what they do, they will copy your content and they will put it to their website. So in another two days, you will have a duplicate data. So when by the time you submit it to your university, it might become what? Data is content is duplicate which is present online. So this past 100% plagiarism check proof. So there is now duplicates here. So what I'll do, I will go further and select more and I will check if there are any duplicate data is there. So this is the third or fourth time I am trying to check a few. Basically you, what you are supposed to do is, you are supposed to go one by one and do it. What I am trying to do is, I'm just choosing randomly to show you how if any duplicate content is found how we can replace it so we found one here this is 25 percent plagiarism so what i'll do i'll copy this line you copy this line i'll go to my report and here i will paste it I mean search you have to say control H or control F I guess paste that and so you can see okay this is the one sorry something I if 
find out here it is so what i'll do now i'll copy this whole data I'll copy this whole data and i go to this website called seo toolstation.com here just paste it and you say okay let me refresh this page once okay go here and paste this you just have to visit this url and paste that whole content and click on spin now click on finish and then copy this copy this and replace this with what you have copied now if you go and again if you do the programming check for that particular line if you want to know let's do that check again can see that uh, legitimized. So what shall we do? If we copy this and again we'll go and click on try new document, paste this, spin, finish, again copy that, go here and check. So it is 100% unique. So this whatever you just pasted that you have to paste here. Good enough.